All right, we're back building this base for the contro uh, motor controller and the transducer base. So I've just put this piece on the bottom down here and that's going to be able to come up underneath here. I already got my toggle bolts secured here. Eventually I'll probably cut those off. But right now, so I'm at right now, now I'm going to go ahead and see if I can do something with the two by four here coming across coming across and that's what that transducer mount's gonna connect to changing gears just a little bit we're back to the back to the boat <laughs> changing that freaking oil changing the oil situation on the explorer or the uh, liberty Waiting for that stuff to, waiting for that cold steel to harden. What I'm doing right now is I'm putting lag bolts up through the bottom. This is going to be securing the, the uh, bracket for the transducer. So that was that little. on top of the toggle bolt. So it'll give me an idea once I test it down where that toggle is. Then I'll uh <laughs> it'll pull down on that toggle. Actually actually flatten the toggle right into it. <laughs> I was gonna Gave it a little bit of This one's loose. Okay, so that gave me an impression of the tug. Both sides. Let's take the drill. Give the toggle a little run here. <laughs> you push me. Go dig a little hole for it. Better impression. I'm gonna flush it up. Might put another one in the middle, but I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I just want to make sure it's we're nice and tight. Just laying in here. Nope, still isn't not deep enough. I like to have this. Have the toggle sitting inside. sitting inside the hole so it's nice and flush on the table. A little better. I've got other tools to do with stuff like this, but. <laughs> mm.
Okay. Maybe if you push in my way. sure I got a couple of clamps. Um, that's not going anywhere. Got a couple of little ones. Alright, so this is what we're doing here. Right, he's all the way up now. <laughs> This could actually stay right on the boat. Right on here. Basically, it's fun. Facing backwards. Yeah, we're putting it forward. Okay. Yep. Okay, so she's gonna be facing, facing backwards, like so. And then, go all the way down. Yeah, looks like I'm gonna have to put another. Get me a longer. Maybe I have to get me a longer pole. All right, we're back. So right now is I'm gonna go ahead and get this plate installed on here, or I think I'm gonna wind up attaching the controller. Right about so could be like that could be like that um, just depends on how I my feel I'm put right here get center on that um, I got I got thinking about it, and I might put a piece of wood across the middle here. So I guess not going anywhere. Um, put a piece of wood down here. It's it's solid. It it's it's pretty solid right now. But I think what I want to do is I want to put a piece of wood across the floor. Attach it to it. It'll still slide. Okay, somehow that freaking thing broke off of here. All right, so I'm thinking what I'm going to do down here is I'm going to take a piece of wood, probably go completely across, and then I'm going to attach it to here to these here and then that'll secure that'll keep this front because I'll be have my I'll have my feet on it or something like that um, 
and that'll keep that'll keep this from rocking back and forth because I'll have this on the boards on the board and that'll keep it lift it up just a little bit light so I can do I'm probably gonna do that um, I should put I should put some little trim oh, there yeah should put a little bit of trim around the outside and I can put stuff put some stuff on here and I don't have to worry about it falling off especially on this end down here um, and that'll be that so with that said I believe I have this squared away right. so the left right left right and then I can control my speeds um, turn it I can, I can turn it at an angle now now I can now I'm facing it so all right looks like that's where we're at um, I could probably use a, one more small C clamp to take the place of this big one um, and oh yeah what I wanted to do is I want to extend I need to extend this probably another six inches down so that's where we're at where we're at all right here's a view from inside the boat is like I said I wanted to be able to control everything left right you go you it's right here but my fingerprint my fingertips the transducer is now right at my fingertips so now I know I don't have to ground myself out I've got I've got some room here I can put my controllers um, my controller for the underwater drone right here I got I've got you know I've got extra room I can just put stuff down um, and then here we are we now have the Everything inside my inside here. I'll close it back up, and that's good because then I'll roll forward. And then if I'm gonna dive from here, I got room to slide my seat back. This will go. This will go forward more now. And then, like I said, if I need to do that, a lot keep that open. Now to move around in here, if I need to go to the front of the boat, I now can move around very easily. I don't have to worry about that great big bench kicking me in the kicking me in the leg as I'm moving around. So um, sit down here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this to a to a board. I'm just going to leave this. I'll be attached to the attached to the boat, and then, like I said, get me a piece of plywood, put it over the top, put it over the bottom. <laughs> so now I can do what I need to do. All right. So if you like, give me a thumbs up and subscribe and share, and we'll catch you on the next searching for.